Good day, Saints. This is your rector, the Reverend Tom Stramack, Jr., and I'm coming to you late in the evening uh, from the hallway in front of uh, our parish offices. You can probably tell this by the uh, sign that is out uh, directing people to our, the various parts of our building. And uh, one of the reasons I'm coming to you from this uh, slightly echoey and but normal uh, place in our uh, in our building is that uh, the vestry is beginning to discern uh, and beginning to think about uh, what it would be like for us to embrace the fact that our building is being used for a number of things and could be used for a number of more things. Uh, we're obviously being uh, used by uh, uh, the Plaza uh, Communitaria, which is a uh, Latino uh, school uh, for adults. Uh, ESL classes and uh, GED classes and other things are held there. The robotics courses are held there, so it's not just for adults, also for kids. Um, and of course, uh, we have, there are also two churches worshiping here. Uh, of course, us, um, uh, All Saints, and uh, then, of course, Todos Los Santos is also worshiping here. Uh, and so all of those things are true, but we also have uh, classrooms that are not being used for anything right now. Uh, they they lie empty, and uh, we also have a playground that's really not being used either. Um, so the the question we're wrestling with right now is, uh, rather than using those spaces uh, to simply generate more income for all saints, um, what would it mean to think bigger than that and to think about the possibility that uh, this building might become a uh, ministry center or a community center, and what would that look like? And uh, what would that be, rather than just saying, oh, we're gonna, we're gonna grab enough people to, uh, to support our congregation, what would it be like for our congregation to be, yet, to be one of a number of things uh, that use this facility? So, lots of things to think about with that. And of course, this coming Sunday, uh, our worshiping congregation, and. Uh, also, uh, Todos Los Santos will be uh, celebrating uh, Palm Sunday, where we will um, liturgically walk with Jesus uh, through Holy Week, through the last week of Jesus' life, uh, beginning on the triumphal entry and uh, ending at the cross. Uh, and so we will observe that liturgically on Sunday, and then uh, we will have Holy Week uh, that week following, and uh, include Monday, Thursday, and Good Friday. Uh, and uh, Easter Vigil and Easter Day services for that. So uh, lots of things going on, of course, uh, this coming week. I encourage you to participate in all of them uh, and uh, as much as you can. Uh, but I also just, uh, encourage you to think about uh, what would it mean for uh, all saints to sort of give up our uh, position at the head of the table and uh, become uh, yet one of a number of ministries uh, or nonprofit organizations or other things um, existing in this facility and existing here. So uh, perhaps a good thought and a good uh, prayer focus for Holy Week. Uh, and uh, I look forward to uh, seeing you. Well, not, I'm not going to see you, but you're going to see me again on uh, Good Friday. And uh, we will um, I'll make a recording at that point, uh, but I certainly hope to see you on Sunday as we uh, celebrate the triumphal entry uh, and uh, move with Jesus uh, through Holy Week. God bless, and I'll talk to you later.